Hey folks, Crazy Climber Eighty here again, and this time we're going to look at a game called Rescue Raider, and this was created by Bally Midway and probably Sente as well in 1987. But time for another flashback episode, so we'll go back to the year 1987. Look at all that went on in 1987 via the Crazy Climber Eighty DeLorean. News events: Pennsylvania Treasurer Bud Dwyer kills himself during a televised press conference, blows his brains out after found guilty of bribery, fraud conspiracy and racketeering very very grisly uh, American Motors is uh, acquired by Chrysler MS uh, Herald of Free Enterprise Ferry caps capsizes in Belgium Harbor and 193 die 19 Vietnamese refugees are killed by the Republic of China Army on mainland China Beach. It, um, it's called the Leu Massacre. AZT is approved by the FDA to treat HIV AIDS. Euro Disney begins construction in Paris. It's later called Disneyland Paris. The Simpsons cartoons debut on the Tracy Ullman show. A Soviet-made airliner crashes outside of Warsaw killing all 183. The USS Stark is hit by two Iraqi air-to-surface missiles and kills 47 sailors. 42 Muslim youths are killed by provincial armed constabulary near uh, Mirat, India. Ronald Reagan uh, challenges Mikhail Gorbachev to tear down the Berlin Wall while he's in Berlin. Uh, Iraq bombs Iran with mustard gas in Sardasht. Video game franchises debut. Uh, Double Dragon, Contra, uh, Metal Gear, and Mega Man. A uh, clash between demonstrating Iranian pilgrims and Saudi security in, Amer in uh, Mecca kills 400. Northwest Airlines Flight 255 crashes during takeoff near Detroit and kills 155. Radioactive material is found at an abandoned hospital in Goiás, Brazil, one of the worst nuclear disasters. Young Jessica McClure, baby, falls down a well in Midland, Texas, and is stuck for three days. It is eventually rescued. Captures America's attention. Two trains collide in Jakarta, Indonesia, Indonesia, and 102 are killed. The U.S. Senate and House of Representatives charge Reagan with responsibility for the Iran-Contra affair. Two Chicago TV stations have their airtime hijacked by a short video of a Max Headroom imposter getting spanked. Very weird. Typhoon Nina hits the Philippines and kills 1,036. South African Airways Flight 295 crashes into the Indian Ocean. All 159 die. Korean Air Flight 858 is blown up by North Korean agents over Andaman Sea. 115 die. Televangelist Jerry Falwell takes Hustler to court over what he perceives to be a slanderous parody ad. He loses the case. A passenger, passenger ferry collides with an oil tanker into the Philippines, killing nearly 1,750. Pacific Southwest Airlines Flight 1771 crashes near Paso Robles, California, killing all 43 after a passenger shoots his ex-supervisor and both pilots. And uh, Prozac is approved for use as an antidepressant by the FDA. Now let's look at celebrity deaths. A lot of famous names. Fred Astaire. Bob Fosse, Jackie Gleason, Rita Hayworth, John Houston,
Danny Kay, Liberace, Lee Marvin, Andy Warhol, Ray Bulger, James Coco, Randolph Scott, Woody Hayes, Robert Preston, Buddy Rich, Paul Butterfield, Alejandro Ray, Sammy Kay, Elizabeth Hartman, Geraldine Page, Clara Peller, Where's the Beef, Quinn Martin, Lauren Green, Mervyn Leroy, Dan Rowan of Laffin, Mary Astor, Jim Brewer, and Punch Imlock, coach of the Maple Leafs. Now let's look at TV shows of 1987. Unsolved Mysteries, Square One, The Bold and the Beautiful, Max Headroom, Married with Children, great show, Tracy Ullman Show, 21 Jump Street, Bionic Six, I had the hots for the mom on that cartoon. Uh, the Days and Nights of Molly Dodd. Animal Crackups. Wise Guy. Out of This World. DuckTales. My Two Dads. Beverly Hills Teens, I love the intro on that cartoon. Full House. Hooperman. A Different World, Tour of Duty, Beauty and the Beast, Jake and the Fat Man, Star Trek Next Generation, uh, 30-something, Friday the 13th, The Series, Remote Control, CBS This Morning, and the first Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles cartoon. Now let's look at Movies of 1987, lots of them, lots of good ones. Untouchables, Last Emperor, Moonstruck, Wall Street, Fatal Attraction, Hope and Glory, Good Morning Vietnam, Mannequin, Nightmare on Elm Street 3, the best of the nightmare movies, uh, Lethal Weapon, Angel Heart, Evil Dead 2, great movie, Raising Arizona, Creep Show 2, Beverly Hills Cop 2, Harry and the Hendersons, Predator, Witches of Eastwick, Roxanne, Spaceballs, Full Metal Jacket, Inner Space, Robocop, love that movie. Living Daylights, James Bond. Lost Boys. Back to the Beach. Stake Out. No Way Out. Dirty Dancing. Hellraiser. Amazon Women on the Moon, kind of funny. Princess Bride. Weeds. Suspect. The Hidden, Running Man, Three Men and a Baby, Throw Mama from the Train, The Dead, Eddie Murphy Raw, had some funny parts, Overboard, and Empire of the Sun, and La Bamba. Now let's look at music number one songs from 1987. Uh, Walk Like an Egyptian, continued from 86. Shake You Down, At This Moment. Um, open Your Heart, Living on a Prayer. Jacob's Ladder, Lean on Me. Nothing's going to stop us now. I knew you were waiting for me. I just died in your arms. With or without you, you keep me hanging on. 
always head to toe I want to dance with somebody alone shake down I still haven't found what I'm looking for who's that girl La Bamba I just can't stop loving you didn't we almost have it all here I go again lost in emotion bad I think we're alone now Moni Moni I've had the time of my life heaven is a place on earth and faith there were also other big hits not number ones but everybody have fun tonight lady in red notorious keep your hands to yourself somewhere out there little lies la isla bonita break out wanted dead or alive you gotta fight for your right to party and hazy shade of winter now let's look at sports of 1987 Super Bowl 21 the New York Giants destroy the Broncos 39 to 20 Phil Smith Phil Simms at quarterback NBA Finals the uh, Lakers beat the Boston Celtics four games to two World Series Minnesota Twins defeat the St. Louis Cardinals four games to three and the Stanley Cup Edmonton defeats the Philadelphia Flyers four games to three. Uh, NCAA basketball championship. Uh, Indiana beats Syracuse 74 to 73. NCAA football title game. Uh, Penn State in the Fiesta Bowl defeats Miami 14 to 10. Boxing. Mike Tyson uh, wins the heavyweight title over James Bonecrusher Smith in Vegas. And uh, Sugar Ray Leonard wins the middleweight title over Marvin Hagler. Golf. Uh, Masters champion is Larry Mize on the right. U.S. Open champ, Scott Simpson kissing his wife. British Open, Nick Faldo is the champ. PGA champ is Larry Nelson. That was 1987. Our look back at 1987. And now let's look at Rescue Raider by Bally Midway. And it seems to run on Sente hardware. So they should probably also get credit. I had never seen this in arcades. It's kind of interesting. It definitely has a Sente feel. In fact, it feels a lot like uh, the classic game Stalker, S T O C K E R, by Sente. Um, the screen that you are on is going to be split into what? Uh, 16 different screens, four wide and four sections. So you could go, there are four, uh, like I said, four sections of each part of the level. And um, your main goal is to get to the top and reach your goal. And once you do, the level ends. But along the way, you can collect different weapons. And there's a weapon on that screen. It's like a big gun icon. And you could get, like, rapid fire. You can get a uh, grenade launcher. Uh, you can get, like, a, a rocket launcher. And you could get, uh, um, you can get air to surface missiles. And you turn into a jet briefly. And then you drop. And then you shoot shoot uh, missiles you can get documents that will tell you where certain things are on the maze and you can collect hostages the documents are also worth some nice points see that document told me that there are special weapons and it told me where they were and the first special weapon I could pick up I think is the rocket launcher some enemies can only be killed by the rocket launcher or the, you know, or the uh, um, air-to-surface missiles or uh, the grenade launcher. 
can't be they can't be killed by your regular shots. And there is that uh, weapon I have to pick up. Oh, I have to go around. But see, it's very much like Stalker. Very much gameplay. Now your special weapons will appear at the top on the right. And uh, you have to press uh, the button to make it work. This game has two double jo has double joysticks. One to aim your uh, where you're gonna shoot, or well, one to shoot in one direction and one to move your tank around. Oh, I died. But uh, you could continue and you continue right where you left off. There are a total of four zones, and the zones are like levels. You don't have to rescue the hostages. You never have to rescue the hostages. And there's one running about. But I got one. The hostages are just points. Uh, but there will be times when you really want to have that... Uh, you really need to have the... Uh, uh, at least the rocket launcher. And you could collect extra fuel to restore your fuel tank. Like I said, when you die, run out of fuel, or die, or whatever, run out of lives, you pick up right where you left off, which is nice, except on the last level. Uh, run out of lives there, and your game is over. But yeah, there will be bigger enemies, like a ginormous tank, or, uh, or planes or something that you will need at least the rocket launcher for. You cannot shoot them with your regular shots. Now we're going to the uh, second level. Now you might think that it, there's like a special bonus if you can destroy all the enemies and collect all the hostages. You can't destroy all the enemies as far as I could tell. It looks like you destroyed them all, but then the game, game tells you that there was like an extra one or something left. And you're like, I destroyed them all, I swear to God. So don't don't bother trying to get them all. But yeah, collect those documents. They are worth extra points and they were tell they will tell you where certain things are in the game. Oops. This game's kinda hard, but it's it's if you liked Stalker, give this one a chance. Kinda interesting. It gets very hard with the uh, enemies just appearing all of a sudden when you enter a an area, they will give you a, a split second or two to, uh, you know, or they will not fire right off the bat, but they will in like a second or so. So take that time to get yourself situated and not get fired upon. I think you'll hear that beeping sound when your fuel is low. Oh, there's the fuel thing. Note that you move much slower over watery terrain. I've gotta, I've gotta get myself a safe passage here before I can touch it. Ah, there we go. That runway is and uh, road makes for very easy to move on terrain. But yeah, water is, is very difficult. Sand is, is very, uh, it slows you down a good deal. And you see your tracks, just like in uh, uh, Stalker. Oops. But yeah, you have to, the exit isn't always going to be in the same place. But uh, you'll need to uh, use your, uh, at least your, uh, rocket launcher to blast through walls to get through the last uh, the last area there and reach the exit there's another document but yeah there will be some enemies that you cannot destroy with your regular shots they will be giant tanks um, oops now I neglect to, to continue here there will be giant tanks there will be uh, there will be uh, uh, like tankers, big enemies that you'll need to use rocket launchers on. If you get the grenade launcher, and we'll look at what that's like later on, you can fire over the tops 
of roofs and there will be enemies on the roofs that you'll only be able to reach with the grenade launcher or with your uh, uh, air to surface missiles that we'll look at later as well but here is you can get some nice points and this is you know this is me getting all these hostages but you cannot I swear to god you cannot defeat all the enemies we'll, we'll zip forward and uh, yeah I've got I've now got uh, the uh, uh, grenade launcher I just wanted you to see what that's like get out of here yeah and you can shoot over the tops of the roofs I put on invincibility by this point just so I can zip through the game quicker and now we'll see the air to surface weapon and you fly up in the air as a plane real quick and you can shoot missiles while you're in the air and now we'll zip through to uh, the last level or no no not quite yet we'll get to the start of level four but yeah again on this final level if you uh, yeah it's cool you can fly over barriers and stuff with the air to surface power but this is a, a kind of a maze here on the last level but yeah if you uh, run out of lives uh, your game is over so uh, don't let that happen and here is the very end this is where you get to your ship or your boat and you take off and you beat the game and, and again yeah I've got invincibility on the game gets crazy hard at points there will be uh, choppers coming after you and stuff that you need to, at least the uh, rocket launcher for you made it congratulations yeah good luck on getting all the enemies destroyed in a level I do not think it is possible like I said you'll swear you got them all and then the game will say that there's like one more yeah. sometimes more enemies will come out if you kinda loiter maybe that's what they required you to have I put on uh, infinite fuel and infinite lives and then I took it off so that the counter could uh, finish but that was rescue raider by Bally Midway in 1987 and probably Sente as well I'll put in my initials kind of an interesting game like I said if you like a stalker give this one a shot but that was Rescue Raider by Bally Midway and Sente I'm guessing in 1987 but thanks also for watching my 1987 flashback episode this was episode number six this is Crazy Clemmer and thanks for watching my 1987 Rescue Raider game and flashback video hope to see you for the next one I'll see you later everybody take it easy bye bye <laughs>